this thing. Yo, yo, yo. It's your boy back at it again with another street beast reaction, man. What kid Savage? Uh, yeah, man, we back at it with another street beast commentary, man. And, uh, we got another MMA match. We got a uh, high definition going against Lumberjack. This was another one from the uh, now. Well, I don't know if it is now, but shoot, I would think like very soon to be viable event. That event there was a uh, very, um, like I said, man, in the last video, man, it was very uh, inspirational, man. It was, um, it was something special, at least for me, because like everybody came in and they are, it was a certain energy or whatever the case may be. I just said this already. I didn't say it in my last video. Uh, and it's like, it was crazy, man. And it's like, you have to really be there in order to understand what I'm saying. But uh, this time we got a high definition going against Lumberjack. Lumberjack, I'm not sure. I might have seen him at a Street Beast event, maybe, but I'm not sure if he ever, if I ever seen him fought or whatever. So I don't, I may be bearing new to this. I don't know if he uh, debuting to the, if he was debuting to the yard that day. But uh, high definition, he been around for a while now. I think probably a year now. Um, he's very, uh, very good fighter, man. Very uh, gritty, man. He give it his all. He um, also had a, like a um, crazy fight with uh, Madman Moses. And I remember that fight because I ended up watching it just to go back and review for this video. So, you know, just show y'all, man, I'm doing some homework now. I'm trying to like make sure I, I can get a little bit more in depth with my uh, commentary or whatever the case. But uh, yeah, man, I seen that fight and like, uh, I don't know what happened that fight. I remember that event though. I wasn't there, but I remember watching it on YouTube or whatever the case. And that event was like, wow, it was kind of crazy. And like uh, that fight there in particular was nuts too. <laughs> It was, I think, it was a debuting of that case, of a new case that they tried or they had or whatever the case. It was, it was something of that order. But um, yeah, he had a fight with Madman Moses. He kind of like currently five and zero, and um, he had a fight with a guy named Dolph, from what I uh, remember. And um, I seen that that fight was kind of like almost controversial, or whatever the case may be. So. I don't know if they're gonna ever run it back again or whatever the case may be, but you know, he's 5-0 right now. He's a fast finisher. And uh, yeah, man, and we got uh, two good guys getting ready to go at it. So uh, without me yammering on, let's get right to it. High definition. He's a heavyweight too, man. Some big guys. Both the same weight, 250. Number Jack, this was a good day, man. Good day for fights, man. Here we go. Touch of the gloves. Our definition coming in patient. Looked like he got a little bit off balance. Number Jack respectfully helps him up. Nice back touch of the gloves. Nice sportsmanship. We're going back at it. Number Jack trying to get into the side or whatever the case, but he's taking some shots. And uh, yeah, man, he ended up taking too many shots and was overwhelmed eventually. I think around this time, I think, I think about this time, uh, high definition needs like a, needs like a title match or whatever the case may be, man, because, like I say, he's 5-0 right now, that, this now makes him 6-0, very fast finish, and like, it's about that time that he finally pretty much, uh, get a title shot, I don't know who's the champ in these, uh, divisions anymore, man, because, with the way some of the belts has been, man, it's kind of like, they all are limbo-like, so, it's very, I don't want to say unorganized, but it's very uh, all over the place, I want to say. I guess that's saying or unorganized. I don't know. I kind of wish, like, there was a little bit more. I mean, I know it's not, you know, meant for the whole competi competitive-wise or whatever, but I think that edge kind of brings about a uh, more, a more friendly competitive edge to it, to where people can understand one another to a point where it's like, you know, we came here, we hashed out our differences, and now, as long as we don't have nothing else to do with it, with, uh, with whatever caused us to have beef in the first place, then we should be straight, you know what I mean? So I just feel like, I don't know, it's a, it's a good place for that, man. And, uh, man, <laughs> HD, man, he's 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 doing his thing, man. I think he need, I think he need um, the title shot, it's about that time. 
Uh, shoot, he's 6-0 now, and uh, he made quick work of this, this, uh, his last fight, this guy here. Man, if anything, man, I would say that would probably be his next step. Probably try to get like a people's champion match. Lumberjack, man, come back, man, train, man. Uh, you know, work some sparring, work some footwork, you know, do a little bit of exercise or whatever the case may be. Just come back and work on your cardio. That's and that's for both guys too, actually. I meant to say that in my last video, but for everybody, man, we all got to work our cardio. Cardio is key, man. Um, yeah, man, just good job by these guys, man. They did their thing, man. But this has been another Street Beast commentary. Hope y'all enjoy. This has been your boy. Peace. Made a path, took her to the bed, asked her for her number. Get me at the math, contact next night.